Good Morning America's Rob Marchino has shared a rare photo with his ex-wife, Erin, as the exes celebrated daughter Madeline's school achievement. Before their divorce became finalized in March, the former couple welcomed two children, Madeline and Mason. In his Instagram post, Rob, 54, revealed his daughter Madeline graduated from F.E. Bellows Elementary School and is moving on up to middle school. Among the sweet photos, the GNA star and his ex-wife, Erin, were all smiles as they posed with their kids. In the group shot, Erin placed both hands on Mason's shoulders while Rob planted his on Madeline's arm. In another wholesome snap, Rob planted his cheek on his daughter's forehead as she held her diploma for the camera. He captioned the post, Elementary school is officially in the books, and Madeline is all grown up. Well, not quite, but she's getting there way too quickly. Rob closed, I'm so proud of her achievements and grateful for the incredible educators. The TV star and his ex were also in good spirits as they celebrated their son's fifth birthday earlier this month. The father of two has not been full-time on the morning show since 2022, when he secretly went through a divorce. In July 2022, the U.S. son exclusively revealed Aaron had filed for divorce after 11 years of marriage. He was absent from the program for many months, which left viewers worried about his position at GMA. Aaron filed for divorce on June 18, 2021, according to New York court records. The former twosome married in November 2010. Despite the divorce, the exes appeared to be co-parenting amicably as they took a trip to Walt Disney World with their kids over spring break last April, according to Rob's social media posts. The meteorologist recently shared a cryptic post about a short lesson about kindness and generosity. He reshared a post from New York University professor Scott Galloway that read, I heard my mom asking our neighbor for some salt. We had salt at home so I asked her why she was asking. She told me, they don't have much money, and they sometimes ask us for things. So I asked for something small that wouldn't burden them. I want them to feel as if we needed them too. That way, it will be much easier for them to ask us for anything they need. 